Hello and welcome to the Adam and Val YouTube channel. On my recent trip to London, I don't know if you saw the vlog when we were up there for Max's birthday, probably two or three months ago now, we went into Harrods and I purchased these coffee pods. Look at these. And the reason I purchased them, well there was various reasons. One, the price. They was only £4.95. Now that's only about a, a pound or even equivalent to a usual Nespresso cost of 10 coffee pods. Also as well, they had various different types. And the other thing is that Adam is the usual Nespresso coffee Spock on this channel. But other than quite a few years ago when we went into Costa and tried all their coffees, I've never really had an espresso. And I really, really like coffee and I like it strong with only a little bit of milk. So Adam said, review those Harrods coffee pods. No, they're not new, but it's an experience to get my first espresso to see if I like the taste of just coffee straight up. Now, the packet says Lungo. And on my espresso machine that you still saw at the start of the video, there's two buttons. There's espresso and Lungo. And Lungo is basically just a double shot. So I went for the, it extracts more water and coffee. I'm not sure of the science but it's a longer drink than what an espresso is. And it's almost just sort of like a, it's not a double shot, but it's a more drawn out one shot, if that makes sense. And because it said Lungo, that's why I went for it. It may weaken it, which may be more preferable to me. Breakfast blend. And it's eight o'clock in the morning, you can't go wrong. There was a description somewhere, here we go. Tasting notes, cashew, malted biscuit, I like both of them, and hot butter. Well, hot butter is one of the greatest tastes ever. So if it does taste of that, then I'm gonna be quite pleased as long as it's not too strong. So I'm a little bit nervous. I am a little bit nervous to try this straight up black Lungo espresso coffee in my posh Nespresso official espresso cup. We'll have a smell. Like I said, Adam, Adam does all the Adam drinks coffee so much that if he had to give blood, he'd have to go to the Nescaf factory. That's how much coffee he drinks. What's it smell? It smells delicious. I love the smell of like fresh coffee. It really smells nice. And I really want to enjoy the taste, but like I said, when I had an espresso years ago, it was too strong for me. But maybe, maybe over the years, my tastes have adapted and I'm going to enjoy it and let's see if we can get what is it malted biscuit buttery hot butter and cashew flavor oh, we're not going to get that are we I'm just going to go because ah, it's too strong right here we go I think that stuff on top is called oh God, that's really nice oh, I think lungo is the way for me to go not espresso because it's not overpoweringly strong. Now this is a three out of five on the Harrods rating, which is the equivalent probably to looking at an espresso, I think that's about a seven or an eight, which is probably the level I would go at when I have it with milk. Um, I have got a 10, which I would have in this glass with just a dash of milk if I'm feeling particularly tight, but that's really tasty. I'm not getting really any cashew or any malt there is a sort of because you when you have hot butter it almost goes a, a tiny bit of a nut flavor so they say in italian i do know what they mean there is that there is almost that buttery flavor to it it's not like you're drinking butter it's a really really nice coffee i've got to be honest and this is the way forward every morning i think i've been missing out i've been too nervous to try this in the past and i'm interested to see how different it would be if it was just an espresso rather than lungo because this has obviously got more water in it which probably suits me like i've already said no well done harrods reasonably priced coffee pods that go in your espresso machines the coffee shop there's fantastic with a great big roasting vat and everything and that is a nice not overpoweringly strong but a decent hit of caffeine with some nice flavors but maybe not exactly the flavors it says on the sin on the tin for more videos where we get up early just to film an espresso coffee, don't forget to like and subscribe. 
Mm. I'm definitely having that again. <laughs>